Hi everyone, my name is Kara B. Welcome to my channel. So today I am going to be doing a taste testing of three plant-based eggnog. I'm so excited. I love eggnog. I mean like love, love, love. Love, 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 love. Eggnog. Uh, however, in recent years I've been eating more vegan and one thing that is my guilty pleasure almost every year around the holiday season is eggnog i've tried plant-based eggnog before i really didn't like it because for me a big part of eggnog is like the thickness of it and i feel like you can only really get that through actual dairy today i have three plant-based eggnogs that i'm going to try with you all today i'm very excited to make this video i think this will be a whole bunch of fun it reminds me of um my holiday drink challenges i just did at starbucks tim hortons and dunkin donuts so make sure to subscribe to the channel and have the notification bell on because those videos will be out soon okay so the first eggnog that i have is this silk eggnog so this is a soy based eggnog and i believe the only time i've ever had a plant-based eggnog was soy soy milk is okay um but it's not my favorite and it's definitely not thick as I oh i've always known soy milk to be thin so this is the first one we're trying. Second one is an almond milk based one, which I'm really excited for because almond milk is actually my plant-based milk of choice. And I don't think I've ever had plant-based almond milk eggnog. And so I'm excited for this. I got this 365. Oh yeah, it says Whole Foods Market right there. Yeah. So I got this from Whole Foods and I got this one from Price Right. And the last one is another one. And this is the holiday, the Califia Farms Holiday Nog. And this is almond milk as well. And I figured because I love almond milk so much, why not try two almond milks? Okay, so before we get started, comment below your favorite non-dairy plant-based milk. Do you like oat milk? Do you like coconut milk? Let me know below. Me, me personally, I've tried them all and I really just always circle back to almond milk. To assist us in the challenge, I have a warm pumpkin loaf from starbucks love them love these <laughs> okay so i'm gonna give it a good shake this is the soy milk i don't know why i'm even pouring so much because honestly i can already tell it's just too thin. It's, yeah, too thin. I can already tell. All right, let's go ahead and try this. Salud. Happy holidays. I mean, to be honest, the taste isn't bad for it. It definitely tastes like eggnog, but it's like the opposite of thick. It's so, so thin. And yeah, that's all I remember. I remember this from drinking soy eggnog before. I personally like the thickness of eggnog. Some people I know think the thickness is a bit too much. So if you don't like the thickness, if that's one of the things that mainly puts you off from eggnog, maybe you might like the silk or the soy-based eggnogs. Okay, so the next one we're going to try is the Almond Nog. I'm really excited for this because I have higher hopes for the Almond Nog, to be honest. I just think that almond milk has more of a chance of being thicker. Mm. It's thicker. A bit. I don't know if you can tell. Alright, let's taste. Mm-mm. No, that was not that great. No. It was just kind of bland. It was thicker than the soy milk, a bit thicker, not by much. Yeah, but the taste was very, very bland. It tasted, it wasn't even vanilla-y. I feel like sometimes when people imitate eggnog, they try to make it more vanilla didn't really like that nutmeg nog taste but yeah that was just really bland it wasn't even vanilla -y. all right and the last one but certainly not least is going to be this califia farms holiday nog almond milk dairy free 
I don't know. I'm like really trying to shake it up to make it thick, you know? I don't know if it's really making it thick or if it's just frothy like. All right, here we go. I have high hopes. You know what? I just want a win for a plant-based eggnog so bad that my hopes are like so high. <laughs> It's just too thin. And I know it's just like you can only get it with real dairy milk. I feel like the thickness It's just like it's all about the thickness, you know. All right, let's try this. It smells good. Mm. That was even worse. That was even worse than the last one. These eggnogs honestly went from bad to worse to worse and I hate to say it not that like I just had high hopes for the almond milk because I like almond milk better than all the other plant-based milk so I just wanted almond milk to hit it out of the park with this but if I'm going to be honest the soy milk tastes the best it tastes the most like real eggnog I mean they're all pretty thin the soy milk is also the thinnest but at least it has the taste the other two I like I don't even know it's like bland tasting and it's not even like they made up with some other sugary taste it's just kind of like a washed out taste i don't know how to ex describe it all right everyone thank you for watching that's the video if we're gonna rank these best to worst i think this one was the winner the soy milk even though this was like exactly what i was trying to avoid this is what i knew eggnog plant-based eggnog tasted like but i had hopes that we can move beyond this but apparently this is the best we got so this is number one the silk eggnog i'll give number two to whole foods brand almond nog and then the third place to the califia farms holiday nog but really the two almond nogs are relatively around the same all right, everyone, well, there you have it. There's the video. Let me know. Have you tried any of these plant-based nogs or do you have any good recommendations for me? Comment below. And do you love eggnog or have you never had eggnog before or have you tried it and never liked it? I always get so many different answers around the holidays when I ask people of eggnog. And I just can't believe how many people don't like it or have never had it because I love it. <laughs> and if this is your first time watching my videos, I mentioned in an earlier Vlogmas video that I'm thinking about changing my channel name from Caribbean TV to Caribbean Is Me. Comment below and let me know what your thoughts are. All right, well, thank you for watching my video. Thank you for liking, subscribing, and sharing. And I'll see you in the next one. Happy Vlogmas, YouTube. Bye.